Well, the Bonner County Sheriff's Office identified a man and a woman who may be responsible for abusing and neglecting more than 30 dogs. The dogs have been recovering at different North Idaho shelters. Crime 2's Janelle Finch is joining us now to share how some of those rescued dogs are doing at the Better Together Animal Alliance in Ponderay. Nearly 10 dogs were brought here to Better Together Animal Alliance in Ponderay one week ago. Staff tell me they came invisibly malnourished and some were just days away from death. Now four of those dogs have been taken into foster homes, including one today. The Huskies at Better Together Animal Alliance are loud and playful. It's hard to believe they weren't always like this. Hi, easy, easy, hello. One week ago, these dogs were rescued in a group of more than 30 neglected and abused dogs found around North Idaho. It was a site director of storytelling, Andrea Nagal, says she's never seen. Whenever you see animals in that kind of condition, it's, it's difficult. Now, they're attracting attention for all the right reasons. Drinking water, being treated for... Um, for whatever ailments they might have. Sorry, I'm very distracted by how cute they are. <laughs> being cute and being healthy. Nagal says four dogs have recovered enough to finish healing in foster homes. Wednesday, a foster family came to pick up Sugar the Husky. Sugar is special to the shelter because she was the first of the abused dogs to arrive at Better Together. Nagal says Sugar would have died if she hadn't been rescued. Talking to Sugar's new foster dad, she will continue to heal and recover in a loving home. So they'll be in foster homes for about two weeks before they're available to adopt. And maybe become a forever part of the family. A lot of our foster families have already said that they might intend to keep them. Wherever these dogs end up, Better Together <laughs> wants to give them the best chance at life and love, something they didn't have before. The Bonner County Sheriff's Office says it is still looking for at least five more dogs. The person who fostered Sugar today tells me him and a group of 15 other people have been working to find these dogs in need. They found at least 10 and are continuing to look for more. In Ponderay, Janelle Finch, Crime 2 News.